Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about how I met your mother. Um, Not how she met my mother, <laughs> but the show How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> oh, I was like, I don't know where you're going with this. I'm confused. Um, yeah, so Adam watched it when it came out, right? Yeah, watched it. Well, I think I, I either started at the beginning or started in like the third season and then watched from then on, but yeah, I was pretty early in the series at least. And then I had seen like episodes here and there. Um, I don't, I don't think I've ever, like, I don't, before we binged it just recently, I had never really seen a full episode. I had seen clips here and there from like it just being on TV. Oh, you threw your donkey. Um, from it being on TV and stuff and my mom watching it. But I had never seen the series, and really I didn't know anything about it. The only thing I honestly remember from, like, the clips was Neil Patrick Harris. Yeah. And it was just, like, them at the bar, and I remember him being at the end, which is, like, every episode. Well, and so, like, all all she had heard was that it's a good show with a terrible ending. Yeah. Um, and I would and, have to agree with that, because that was my opinion um, but, like, from, from the ending, like, to me, like, it was just really, honestly, the last, like, five, ten minutes of the last episode, like, it really was a good ending up till the point where you figure out something, and I don't know if I want to spoil it if you guys ever want to watch it, um, but, like, Gabby didn't know anything I thought about the, the whole, because Adam even had said it in the past, like, when we had watched Dexter forever ago, and we were talking about that ending, he was like, I still think How I Met Your Mother was worse. And so I, going into it, thought it was, like, the entire last season. Like, a lot of people would say, like, Scrubs is the same way. And so I thought it was the entire last season, not what then I later found out was Adam's, like, last ten minutes. I think after the big event, that's the entire last season that one event ended, I think it could have ended that episode and just thrown on the alternate <laughs> ending to the end of that episode. Yeah, I mean, you just, like, you think that the last three or four episodes were bad. Yeah. One of my favorite things about the show is that it's really, like, easy to like. Um, it's very funny. There's a lot of the character development, um, just, like, for different characters and, and the characters that they picked out. Um, I mean, I find them just hilarious like Barney's character is just the funniest thing um and like you know him being a womanizer is funny um and then you get Ted that's just the hopeless romantic um Marshall that's just like you the know country a, bumpkin. yeah but that's... also a large teddy bear yeah. um but I mean like and there's there's so many moments in the show where like even even going through a second time and and maybe even like this might have been, like, a third time for me for some episodes. Um, like, I still cried <laughs> multiple times because, <laughs> you know, like, some of the things that happen in the show are just so emotional and you're so invested in these characters. Alternate ending or real ending? I definitely prefer <laughs> the alternate ending. Um, yeah. Because I remember watching the show and I was mad. Like, it was, it was one of those shows where... Like, you get to the end, and you're just like, so we've watched it this long, and this is what happens. And it was just, it was frustrating for me. Um, and then when they released the alternate ending, it, like, it was great. That that fulfilled it for me. Um, I still don't like what happened, but I th it was inevitable. And I think the, the biggest thing that frustrated me was that because there were all these, um, like, clips of the kids and stuff... Basically, the kids were the same age all throughout this because, you know, Ted was talking to them about how he met, like, their mother. And the biggest problem to me was they knew how it was going to end in the beginning. And so, like, I, like, that's what frustrated me is it took so long to meet the mother because we don't meet her until the end of the seventh season. Um, and then it just, like fails <laughs> in that regard to me um so like i mean i love the show and it's a great show and i'd watch it again um but the ending for me could have 
been done better. I feel like I wasn't as critical of the ending ending. So, like, what happens in terms of, like, the mom and stuff I'm okay with. It's the after effects of that. Because, I mean, at the end of the day, the mom's a character, but she's not a main character. She's just kind of, well, I mean, she's a flat character in terms of, like, development or anything like that. I didn't care about the mother as much. I mean, I wanted good things for her. I think one of my favorite episodes is the How My Mother Met You one. Um, because, like, I was sitting there crying and I'm like, I don't even care about her as a character that much. Mm -hmm. Um... Mine is definitely uh, slaps giving every time that, well, anytime the slap bag comes up, I think it's just hilarious. Um, and if you don't know what that is, you'll find out if you're watching it. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, I, it's a great show. Um, it's one of my favorite like sitcom slash comedies. Um, and it's definitely worth the watch if mm -hmm. you've never seen it. Um, just because the characters flow so well together and, there's a lot of ups, there's a lot of downs, there's a lot of funny things, um, and it just makes it a great show to watch. So, out of ten, how many yellow umbrellas would you give it? Yellow umbrellas. Um, I don't know, would you give it blue French horns? No. <laughs> Not uh, at all. So, I'd probably, I don't know, I'd probably say it's like eight and a half or a nine in my opinion. Um mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, I think I think it's a good show overall, just that yeah. last episode. Yeah, I would say like seven or half or eight. Or should we say one, because there's only one mother. But do <laughs> If you want more of this kind of thing, um, we watch shows a lot. We have a ton of movies. Um, and we'd definitely be willing to review some things or whatever. Um, but yeah, if you want more of this, uh, comment and let us know. Um, and maybe we'll make some more. So if you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, we post Sundays and Wednesdays, and we're really looking forward to Sunday's video. See you guys. See ya.